Alright guys, welcome back to my channel and today we will take a look at the Sikaran Battle Tank. So I finally finished building this guy up. A uh, few problems that I ran into was this thing wasn't straight, if you've seen the previous video. So I just took my mom's hair dryer and you know, decided to um, warp this up and you know it's all good now. So that's pretty cool. I really love this auto cannon. These giant auto cannon. That looks good. Okay. Uh, I didn't put a hatch. Uh, didn't do the hatch here because I'm thinking of getting the top mount turret just in case I have room for two more points for a storm bolter. So I just left that there. There you go. Um, as you can see, I went along with the. Um, along with the uh, last cannon sponsons. Uh, by the way, this is pretty heavy. Well, if you build one before. This is a full resin kit, by the way. So the only, at first I was like trying it out, I was wondering why it wasn't like going in well. Um, so it was because it was really warped. So when I had to warp this, like I had to warp this up, this up. Uh, to just have everything fit but even though I've worked all that it's still as you can see it's still a little bit warped but it's you know it's highly noticeable and I had to work these uh, these up right here if you can see that I had to warp this part right here too just to get it that straight alright um, also, I had to buy a saw because it was a uh, the sprue that I was attached to was pretty thick right here. So, if you're planning to buy one, I highly recommend you know going to like Hobby Lobby or some type of hobby store and get one of these um, saws before you get one. Really handy and it'll, you know for your future resin cast models, you know it'll be great handy thing to have. So yeah, this is my review. Um, also another thing, it's um, when I was building it and I was looking at the pictures, like when I saw this, like right here in this part right here, I was wondering like why is that like touching there and it's not all aligned and there's like a big gap. Apparently it was like that from the, um, it was like that when, from the instruction sheet and it was, that part and I was like trying to push it back trying to figure out why is it so um, far out right there it's like oh that's how it looked like so that's how it was oh another thing that I had was um, these uh, a sprue was attached attached here but you know not that's not too bad that's you know doable with the green stuff if you can see that so it's like ruined. Same for the other one. So I still have to clean this up. You know, but still, you know. Um, yeah, so it, it turned out great. That's a few things to work on. But yeah, that's this is the Sikaran Battle Tank. So thanks for joining me, guys. And I hope I see you guys again soon. Bye bye.